Any God that don't work on Sunday Ain't no God that could work for me you take what was written with man's hands Hide you know that Let's start with the serenity prayer God, grant me the serenity to accept the things that I cannot change Courage to change the things that I can And the wisdom to know the difference can someone please read for us the 12 steps? I'll read it. The 12 steps of Alcoholics Anonymous. One, we admitted we were powerless over alcohol, that our lives had become unmanageable. Two, came to believe that the power of ourselves to Where do they get this stuff? It stands. The donut place? Yeah. It sucks. Yeah. <laughs> Isn't it great? <laughs> Are your taste buds made of asbestos? Not the first time I've been asked that. So, where do you want to start? Eight. Eight? Why eight? I don't know. Just want to get it over with, I guess. Nope. What? Look, if you're going to do this, then do it. There's no getting it over with. You got to live in it, all of it, every minute of every day. All right? So. We're gonna start at the beginning. Step one. I mean, isn't it enough that we're just sitting here? I, I'm at meetings. Because you have to be. No, because I chose to be. Not much of a choice, though, was it? I still chose it, didn't I? I wanna hear you say it. Come on, man. <laughs> Fine. I'm powerless over alcohol and my life has become unmanageable. Okay. Now, say it again, but like you mean it. Fuck you. I'm powerless over alcohol. And my life has become unmanageable. How's that feel? Like this coffee might actually kill me, it tastes so bad. <laughs> well, you know, sometimes you gotta have a bad cup of coffee to know what a good cup of coffee tastes like. I don't mind a bad cup of coffee, but this tastes like it was brewed with cigarettes and asshole. Taste a lot of asshole in prison, did you? Sorry. Can we skip step two? Nope. Please. Nope. I'm not doing the God shit. Not how it works. I don't believe in God. That's fine. Step two doesn't make much sense then, does it? We're still gonna do it. There's not some other way? Nope. Look, it's about surrender. It's about letting go. All right? So it doesn't matter how you define your higher power. It just matters that you have one. If there was a God, you don't think that he would do something? What do you mean? <sighs> man, look around, man. The world's a fucking nightmare. It's diseases and war crimes and wildfires. And I, I get it. We're tiny. We're your ants scuttling around a sandbox. That's what you want me to say, right? No, not really. But you're getting warmer. If there was a God, 
You really think he's not the one holding the magnifying glass? God doesn't kill people. Yes, says you. He didn't kill that girl. No. I did. Fuck. All right, we're doing this. Night before the accident, I'm uh, driving home. And I'm, uh, I don't know, six, seven deep. Just drunk enough to not feel anything, you know? I even have a beer in my hand. And suddenly there's a cop in my rear view, pulls me over, bump taillights, some shit. And uh, as soon as I roll down the window, I know he can smell it. It stuck to me, that smell. So I get out the car, he cuffs me right away. And I'm not scared. No, what, what I feel is relief. Like maybe it'll stop. Maybe I can finally settle up. You know what happens next? We hear these tires screech up the street and, and this loud crash and all the glass and the metal and, and uh, the cop sighs. He unlocks the cuffs and get this, he hands my beer back to me and says, I guess this is your lucky night. Gets in his car, speeds off. If there was a moment for anyone to be saved in this whole thing, that would have been it. If there was a God, I would have been sleeping it off in a cell instead of back behind the wheel of that car. If there was a God, he would have saved that girl from me. I don't know why things happen. There aren't answers to questions like that. But what I do know is that God can take these things and make them better, turn them into something good. You believe that? I do. You gotta believe something.
Now, we are going to move into open sharing. Would anyone like to start? I'll go. Hi, Lisa, alcoholic. Hi, Hi Lisa. Lisa. Didn't think I'd see you here. I almost didn't come. Sorry you had to see that. One of those nights, you know? Fuck this. Sorry? I said fuck this. S steps, traditions, promises, making amends. Accepting the things we can't change and changing the things we can't accept is fucking bullshit. All of it doesn't work. No, it does. You were there the other night, same as me. And if that's not proof God exists, I don't know what is. Fuck that. You know how I know that God exists? Yesterday, I had 16 years, 8 months, 23 days. And last night, I got into my car, and it's like autopilot. You know, one minute I'm backing out of my driveway, the next minute I'm in that parking lot. And at that exact moment, God shows up. And he's wearing your face. And now, today, I've got 16 years, 8 months, 24 days. See? Look, when it all shakes out, when the plane is going down, when the house is on fire, we all say God. It's just in us like a reflex. But when God shows up, he looks like you and me. See? We need the bad days, because sometimes... You need a bad cup of coffee to know what a good cup of coffee tastes like. <laughs> hey. You know what the envelope said to the stamp? What? Stick with me, kid, and we'll go places. <laughs> <laughs> Do you always suck in code? Oh, come on, it's a metaphor. It's, it's a pretty a... shitty one. Yeah. yeah. How's your coffee? Gross. Yours? Oh, awful. Awful. Yeah. Be great, though. Isn't it? Yeah. 